What's up, YouTube? Digger Man Fly with another update on the SEX10 Honcho from Axial. I did a little bit of upgrades here and there. Let me show you one of the upgrades I've done. Okay, it's driving, driving. Oh, I gotta hit the brakes here real quick. Okay, and then when I back it up, there's a backup. Check this cool little thing I did here. Actually, put one of the signals right here. If you could only check it out, let me. There it goes right here with my Dremel. Let me clear it out. There you go with my Dremel. I Dremel the uh, the the um, little light signal lights as well as on the other side. Right, left. Okay. Let's turn him around real quick. Let's uh. Let me show you some, something. Okay. Okay. Let's uh, show you here. Here he comes. Right and left. Right. Right, left, the winch, come to the winch, you have to change the settings here, okay, right, left again, Right? It's a whole mess in there for the lights, but these lights you could actually put them up however you want. There's so many different ways of setting it. It's all in that little control box in there. All you have to do is just set them up however you want. Left again. Right. When I drive, just the fog lights on the bottom and the regular lights come on there you go you see the fog lights on the bottom right here they come on but yeah that's a little update on the, the honcho let me show you um the venom now let's park this this bad boy here okay park him there there you go check the hazards out uh oh, what's going on? What's going? There's a party going on in there. Look at that. There's a party going on. Okay, so that's that one. Let's turn this one off real quick. And then let's turn on the. First, we gotta change the radio here. That's SEX to Venom. Okay, and here's the Venom. Got the Venom. There's a little, um, this one's brushless. I'm sorry, guys. I think it's a little too fast here. I'm trying to control it. And... Okay, so the Venom, I took the old, the old light system from the Honcho. And I took the the fog lights from the Hancho and I actually dremeled holes. I drilled holes, used some um screws underneath the the axial screws underneath, and I uh screwed them up in there and the two extra lights for the front fog lights I actually use them as ground effects, so they're just creating this nice little effect on the servo and on the um the linkage, but those are the ones in the front. Okay, they're sturdy. Look at that. They're pretty sturdy. I can move the entire car just by moving one headlight. Okay. And now, let me show you the back. There goes the back tail lights. Same thing. Dremeled some holes. You can see the cables come out through some holes here. And they go in directly inside. Uh, let me uh, focus it in. There we go. 
and they go directly into the uh, the tail light. You can see the cable is running through. I put the module up here, and I have it plugged in channel three, um, just for a little quicker. But that's uh, that's the update on the um, the Venom. Soon I'm gonna mount a servo here, flip these this way, and um, yeah, flip these this. There we go. Let's get some focusing. Flip these backwards, flip these backwards, and I'll have rear steering soon. Just put a servo plate here. I got a custom one I made. Put it there, and it'll be perfect. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It's the brushless uh, kind. Everything's tucked in. Custom made, heavy duty, drive shaft. Yeah, that is custom made. Look at it. Look at that. Custom made. Heavy duty drive shaft. Not gonna show you that much because I have a little um, tip on doing those. Then you're gonna have to pay me. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, that's uh, the update on that one. Wants to see a little quick running video. Okay, let's uh, let's see if we can set it up here. It's actually pretty quick. All you can hear is the tires. Let's try to climb the, the wall. Let's see what happens. Oh. Let's climb over something over here. Let's see, the ground effects are doing its work. Let's, uh, Let's climb this sofa here. Look at that. There you go. Climb the sofa. Oh, fail. But, yep, that's an update on my trucks. Rate, comment, subscribe. I'm sorry, it's just a quick video. I'm using my uh, Apple iPhone 4G 16 gigs. Pick one up at your local AT&T store. These things are awesome for shooting videos for YouTube. And that one's crashed. Um, but yeah, rate, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks.